Hello everyone, I am Mayank and welcome to this video on what is transfer learning by Simply Learn. Do you know training a classifier to distinguish beverages can help predict the cuisine of an image? To know more about transfer learning and how it works, stay tuned till the end of this video. In this video, we will cover topics like what transfer learning is, how transfer learning works. Moving forward, we will dive into why you should use transfer learning. After that, we will cover the steps to use transfer learning and at the end, we will see popular model trained using transfer learning. And let me tell you guys that we have regular updates on multiple technologies. If you are a tech geek in a continuous hunt for the latest technological trends, then consider getting subscribed to our YouTube channel and press that bell icon to never miss any update from Simply Learn. By the end of this video, I can ensure that all your questions and doubts related to transfer learning will have been cleared. Also accelerate your career in AI and ML with our comprehensive postgraduate program in AI and machine learning. Boost your career with this AI and ML course delivered in collaboration with Purdue University and IBM. Learn in demand skills such as machine learning, deep learning, NLP, computer vision, reinforcement learning, generative AI, prompt engineering, chat GPT and many more. You will receive a prestigious certificate and ask me anything session by IBM. With 5 capstone in different domains, using real data set, you will gain practical experience. Master classes by Buddy University and IBM experts ensure top-notch education. Simply Learn Job Assist helps you get noticed by leading companies. This program covers statistics, Python supervised and unsupervised learning, NLP, neural network, computer vision, GAN, SCARES, TensorFlow and many more skills. So why wait? Enroll now and unlock exciting AI and ML opportunities. The course link is in the description box below. So without any further ado, let's get started. So what is transfer learning? Transfer learning is machine learning refers to reusing a pre-trained model to improve prediction on a new task. It involves using knowledge gained from a previous assignment to tackle a related problem. For instance, a model trained to recognize backpacks can also be used to identify other objects like sunglasses. Due to the substantial CPU power required, this approach is widely utilized in computer vision and natural language processing tasks, including sentiment analysis. So moving forward, let's see how transfer learning works. So how does transfer learning work? In computer vision, neural networks have distinct objectives for each layer, detecting edges in the first layer and identifying forms in the middle layer and capturing task specific features in the later layer. Transfer learning utilizes the early and center layers for a pre pretend model and only retrains the later layer. It leverages the label data from its original task. For instance, if you have a model trained to identify backpacks in images and now want to use it to detect sunglasses, we will retrain the later layers to understand the distinguished features of sunglasses from the other objects. So moving forward, let's see why should you use transfer learning. Transfer learning offers several advantages including reduced training time, improved neural network performance in most cases and the ability to work with limited data. Training a neural model from scratch typically requires a substantial amount of data which may not always be readily available. Transfer learning becomes valuable in such scenarios. Here is why you should consider using transfer learning. First one is efficient use of data. With pre-trained models, you can perform well even with limited training data that is especially beneficial in tasks like NLP where obtaining large label data sets can be challenging and time confusing. The second one is faster training. Building a deep neural network from a scratch of a complex task can be time consuming, taking days or even weeks. By leveraging transfer learning, the training time is significantly reduced as you start with a model that has already learned general features from a related problem. Now moving forward, let's see steps to use transfer learning. The first one is training a model to reuse it. In machine learning, training a model involves providing it with the data to learn patterns and make prediction. Once a model is trained on a specific task, it can be reused and repurposed for related tasks, saving time and computational resources. The second one is using a pre-trained model. A pre-trained model is a model that has already been trained on a large data set for a specific task instead of training a model from scratch. Using a pre-trained model as a starting point allows us to benefit from the knowledge it has gained during its previous training. The third one is extraction of features. Feature extraction is a process in which meaningful patterns and characteristics are identified and separated from a raw data. In the context of machine learning, it involves identifying relevant information from input data to feed into a model for a better prediction. The fourth one is extraction of features in neural networks. In neural networks, feature extraction involves 
identifying important patterns or features in the data at different network layer. The early layers typically capture simple features like edges, while deeper layers capture more complex features relevant to the task at hand. This hierarchical representation enables neural network to learn and generalize from the data effectively. So moving forward, let's see some popular models trained using transfer learning. So numerous machine learning models have been trained using transfer learning. Some popular ones include the first one is VGG16 and VGG19. These models were trained on the ImageNet dataset for image classification test. The second one is Inception V3. These models were pre-trained on ImageNet and are known for their effectiveness in object, I repeat, in object detection. I repeat in object detection and object recognition. The third one is BERT, bidirectional encoder representation from transformer. This language model is pretend on the extensive text collection and find extensive application in NLP tasks like sentiment analysis and named entity recognition. The fourth one is GPT, generative pre-trained transformer series. These models are pretend language models for various NLP tasks. These are just a few examples of pre-trained models that have been used in transfer learning to accelerate training and improve performance across different tasks. And with that, we have come to end of this video on what is transfer learning. I hope you found it useful and entertaining. Please ask any question about the topics covered in this video in the comments box below. Our experts will assist you in addressing your problem. Thank you for watching. Stay safe and keep learning with Simply Learn. Staying ahead in your career requires continuous learning and upskilling. Whether you're a student aiming to learn today's top skills or a working professional looking to advance your career, we've got you covered. Explore our impressive catalog of certification programs in cutting edge domains, including data science, cloud computing, cybersecurity, AI, machine learning, or digital marketing. Designed in collaboration with leading universities and top corporations and delivered by industry experts, choose any of our programs and set yourself on the path to career success. Click the link in the description to know more. Hi there, if you like this video, subscribe to the Simply Learn YouTube channel and click here to watch similar videos. To nerd up and get certified, click here.